and Miss World 2000 is Miss India. While the West has turned its back on Miss World, India has excelled. In the last seven years, Miss India contestants have won six of the world's top beauty titles. These new jewels in the crown have been selected from 3,000 hopefuls across India. One of them will become a woman in a billion and take the Miss India title. On stage, Medha walks like a beauty queen, but what she says behind the scenes is a very different story. I am a person who is painfully truthful. I cannot say, oh yeah, okay, how are you? Yeah, I'm so good, I love you. And inside say, oh fucking bitch, do I hate you or do I hate you? I cannot do that. Sonal's pictures suck. I don't know, they've just raped that girl's face. Jasraman has droopy everything. Okay, droopy eyebrows, droopy eyes. <laughs> fucking, I hate that babe. God is, um... Oh, I'm too good for this crowd. What am I doing here? Allah will take care of me. Allah is everything. She's a fucking religious fanatic. If they have a title for the biggest bitch, that goes to me. <laughs> the biggest bitch in town. Downtown Mumbai, the five-star Meridian Hotel, home for the next 40 days to the highest concentration of beautiful women in the world. It looks like a luxury hotel. In reality, it's a production line, a boot camp factory for making beautiful women perfect. The camp is the brainchild of India's glossy women's magazine, Femina. The beauty business is big business. Beauty queens are not born, they're made. And India has made more than anyone else. For a country like India, because it's a very new, uh, new feeling to have winners, a new feeling of pride of our, in our women, it's still big. Maybe 20 years down the line, we'll have had so many winners, we won't be interested in anymore. But right now, it's giving all of us a sense of pride. It's giving all of us a sense of belonging in an international society, that we are on par, we are good. And today, people are saying, hey, some of the most beautiful women come from India. Medha is a well-established model from southern India. She's 20. She's absolutely Western in her outlook and believes she's got what the judges are looking for. They want somebody who's uh, very poised, very stylish, very polite, humble, mm, sexy. Mm, gotta be a bit of everything, you know. And whatever you do, you gotta be good at it. So that's what they want. And I think I can live up to that image. In the next 40 days, the 26 finalists will be pushed to their limits and beyond by India's most demanding trainers. In previous years, the appearance of semi-naked women in beauty pageants has provoked riots in India. But the disapproval of die-hard traditionalists isn't going to stop the beauty machine.